Hello there, let me take this opportunity to welcome every new subscriber and even those who haven't subscribed, please subscribe and feel welcome. My name is Edith Wanyonyi and this is the space where we discuss matters concerning mental health. Today's topic is on what to expect during the first therapy session. I decided to share on this topic because I realized that so many people shy away from attending therapy because they either have the wrong information or they just afraid of what to expect. When you get to the therapist's office, your initial experience will be like that of a doctor's appointment because you'll be required to sign in, then you will wait at the waiting room. The therapist will then receive you and they are usually very welcoming people. So they will create trouble with you, then they will ask you a few questions like what brings you to therapy? What are some of your expectations? What symptoms are you experiencing? They will also ask about your educational background. They'll ask about your family history. They will want to know your medical history. They will want to know your childhood and uh, your career and your current situation. They will then share with you about themselves. And what they are likely to share is their educational background, their career experience, uh, their professional bodies they've registered with, and their area of expertise then they will take you through the counseling process maybe what to expect and what not to expect um, then they will give you some forms uh, these are the client intake form the consent form and the questionnaire of your symptoms the client intake form is where you will fill in your biography your family history and your medical history including your current medical history then the consent form is an agreement between you and your therapist so it will include uh, maybe the the time uh, the cash that you'll pay them it will include confidentiality and the bridge of confidentiality so you'll be required to sign the consent form then the questionnaire of your symptoms is where you'll fill in the symptoms that you're experiencing. I would also like to mention that be very open, be honest, have realistic expectations and goals, be prepared to express your feelings, uh, get in touch with your feelings for you to be helped because uh, a therapist cannot read your mind. So it's upon you to express to them what you're feeling so that they can help you. Basically, your first therapy session is just a period for you and your therapist to get to know each other and uh, just get a rough idea of how you proceed with the other sessions. So don't uh, expect to get any solutions on the first day uh, because uh, therapy is, is, is long lasting. It's a process, you know, so and, and this is a process to equip you with skills with insight, with knowledge, and also to empower you for long-lasting solutions and not just an instant solution. Therapy is very important and for it to be successful, it needs patience, it needs time, it needs courage, it needs effort, and it also needs finances, but it is worth it. Thank you so much for watching this video and until next time, bye!